Welcome guys to the Crochet Beats channel. In this video tutorial again I want to show you how to crochet a Christmas snowflake. Really great one, easy one and is usually perfect for decoration your Christmas tree, your Christmas presents or any knit and crochet projects. The first one I already washed in um, water with glue. That's why it, it looks uh, more rigid. You may also use cotton yarn. Today I'm going to use um, medium weight yarn, 100% uh, acrylic yarn and 3 millimeters crochet hook. So we start with chain 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and let's join in first chain now chain 3 we count chain 3 as first double crochet and then chain one so in total chain four here now make a yarn over and a double crochet into the center that we just formed chain one so this is the same chain four the same as one double crochet plus chain one so in total we need to make 12 double crochet so this is the third one double crochet chain one after that again double crochet chain one this is four double crochet chain one five Double crochet, chain one, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, and six more. Double crochet, chain one, seven, eight, nine. Ten, eleven, and the last one, twelve. Don't forget about chain one and join. Insert chain. So find the third chain one, two, three, and join with slip stitch. Next round, make a slip stitch in next chain one space. Now chain five, and one single crochet in next chain one space. And that's what we are going to repeat. Chain five. One single crochet in next chain one space. Chain five. One single crochet in next chain one space. Chain five. One single crochet. Little bit faster. I hope it's clear. Please go on repeating chain five, one single crochet in next chain one space. So that's what we have now. And now we need to make for the last time chain five, but we make chain two and make double crochet into the first chain five space. 
you make a double crochet in this way. And here we start next round. Chain one into the same chain five space where you did just one double crochet. Make one double crochet. Another double crochet. Now make picket stitch. So chain three and slip stitch underneath through the top of last double crochet of last two loops. Slip stitch. Now one double crochet into the same chain 5 space. Now make treble crochet, treble crochet means yarn over twice and make picket stitch but already not chain 3 but chain 4 and slip stitch through the top. Now go on working into the same chain 5 space. One double crochet. One more double crochet. Now picket stitch like we did at the very beginning. Chain 3. Just a second. Chain three and slip stitch, and one more double crochet into the same space. Great. Into the next chain five space, make chain one and into the third chain out of five make one single crochet into the middle one. Now chain one and let's repeat into the next chain five space make now two double crochet now pick a stitch slip stitch now one more double crochet, now treble crochet, yarn over hook twice, yarn over pull through two, yarn over pull through two and yarn over pull through two three times. Now picket stitch but chain four and slip stitch through the top. Now two double crochet into the same space. Now picket stitch, chain three, slip stitch, and one more double crochet into the same space. So we've got the second point. Now chain one, make one single crochet into the next chain five space, make it into the central chain, chain one, and let's repeat once more. There snowflake point here into the next chain five space. Two double crochet. Now picket stitch. Now double crochet. After that treble crochet. Picket stitch, 
chain four. Now two double crochet into the same space. Picket stitch, chain three. And one more double crochet. Chain one, one single crochet in next chain five space in central chain, chain one again, and repeat everything what we did before. Two double crochet, picket stitch, one double crochet, one treble picket, then two double crochet, picket, and one double crochet. So repeat for three more times, and I will see you after. So at the end, you remember we did chain two and one double crochet here, so the double crochet is here. Cut the yarn and we are going to join in this double crochet. So pull the tail underneath both loops this way and now into the center of their last chain. Like this, we did an invisible join. That's it. Weave in ends. Don't forget to starch it, or as I did, I just washed it. I dissolved a little bit of glue in water and washed it in in this water, and then dry flat. You can pin it. I didn't pin it, by the way. Thank you so much for watching this tutorial with me. Please check the written instruction on my blog. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel.